G'day everyone, Connor here from CW's Tech Reviews and today we're going to do a RAM management comparison between the Moto Z and the Galaxy S7 and see which one comes out on top. So let's just get straight into it, I'll just quickly show you. Nothing in the background on either phone. And I'm just going to run through this series of apps. I'm not going to time it, we're just going to see which one loads quicker. So let's start off with Facebook. Definitely the S7 on that one. Google Plus. Tie. Facebook Messenger. Tie. Pinterest. Ooh, tie. That's close. Facebook Pages Manager. S7. Twitter. Looks like, I'd say a tie again. Instagram. Well, I'd say that was equal. XDA. Well, equal again. LinkedIn. Oh, have to be a tie again. YouTube. Uh, I'd say the um, Moto Z just snuck ahead with that one. Play Music. S7. Play Movies. Tie. And Netflix. Well... I'd say S7 opened quicker, but Moto Z went to the page I wanted first. Alright, now we're just going to quickly go through recent apps. We'll go back to the last one. Equal, both still loaded. Google Plus, reload them both. Or we'll adjust to the Moto Z. Facebook Messenger, Equal, Pinterest, Equal, Pages Manager, Equal, Twitter again, It's pretty equal. Instagram. Equal. XDA. Equal. LinkedIn. Went to the S7. YouTube, equal, play music, equal, play movies, equal, and Netflix, equal. Now none of them had to reload which is interesting. I guess I'd have to give the edge to the Galaxy S7. Moto Z performed really well, but there was a couple there where the Galaxy S7 definitely opened faster. Let me know what your thoughts are. Thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe, share, like, comment, all that stuff, and I'll catch you in the next one. Check ya.